Hello friends, welcome back to Subnautica with your host Wrong with a Bold. I've been busy, 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 busy guy. Um, so long! <laughs> so, I crafted, yes, I crafted an island. It's a little floaty here, but we don't, we ignore that. We, it's pumice, pumice, so, which is fine. Um, I did a lot of gathering. I went ahead, went back over to the landmass. Uh, I scanned um, the gro indoor grow bed again, and I scanned the observatory again, um, so I got those. Uh, and I, so anyway, I had this area here. Do I actually have the... Oh crap, I didn't get the other grow bed. Oh, I gotta go back there again. Okay, I'll go back <laughs> again between episodes, and I'll grab the other freaking other grow bed. Ah, that's annoying. I should have checked that. Any hue, so I've got uh, things built up a bit. Uh, I went ahead and I went back over to that island that I found. I dropped a beacon there, so that's good. Um, I also put a beacon for the base, finally, so that's there. Um, yeah, and I put this up. So let's go in. Welcome aboard, Captain. So I figured it'd be nice to have a nice, easy entryway back and forth, so... Up here on top, I'm going to put, uh, actually, I'm going to put, uh, some winders. 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 Oh, I need more glass. Okay. Uh, I'll get some glass. We'll get some glass. Okay, anyway, I have some winders here. And this is the, uh, watery level <laughs> where the plane of the water goes right through. Um, let's see. But isn't that cool? That's cool. Oh, that's cool. And then over here, I got a good view of the base. Well, not a great view, but a good view. A, a view! All right. And this also goes to... I've got a hatch underwater here. I might build onto that later on. But I, What I want to do is put a bunch of indoor grow beds here. Actually, let's go ahead and put an indoor grow bed in. Okay, we'll put one right... Oops. Right there. Beautiful. Let's do another one. Since one thing I do have is titanium. I I went ahead and I got a I, I spent a lot of time just picking stuff up. Um, as a matter of fact, I also want to get some. Um, I don't have any, uh, let's bring some seeds up. Um, anyway, uh, what did I do? I did things. There were things that I did. Uh, I'll show you what I did. Right, let's go back down. So we gotta go down a few levels. So one, so that's one floor, two floors, three floors, four floors, <laughs> five floors, and then we hit the we hit the uh, tank. So we go down one more floor, and then the tank goes up four floors, I believe. So anyway, so there's one level, two levels, three levels, four levels. Yeah, five levels deep. I planted some creep vine over here. And I just dropped a couple new eggs. In this one? Yeah, right there. Creature sacks. Um, so we'll see what those pop into. And there's one more egg around here, too. No, there's not. There's just those, those two, which I think are the same species, but we'll find out. All right, anyway, hop out here. So that one's still going well. I've got two of the those things. They don't seem to be breeding though, so I'm not sure. I don't want to eat them. How you doing? Eight percent. Oh, I think it's actually got one in there. Yep, excellent. Good with that. Actually, let's go ahead and drink it. Drink. All right. Titanium. Uh, I got a bunch of ingots made up as well because I also focused on getting crystals. Um, I also focused on getting a nice supply of parts. Uh, I found the last piece of the Cyclops. So we are going to build the Cyclops in this episode. Uh, why do I keep hauling this one around? It's garbage. I wish it was a garbagey thing. I've been dumping some other garbage outside, but um, 
So titanium, these are full now. That one's almost full. I've uh, got all that good stuff, lithiums and stuff. This one is pretty much filled up. Oh, we need um, for the stalker teeth. Um, I think we need this and two for an enamel class. Benzene glass. And now glass is stock and tooth and glass. So we need to do glass. So I think we need five uh, enamel glass for the Cyclops. So we need to go kill some stalkers. All right, nice. Um, so I'll put that component over here. Enamel glass. Yeah. Um. And then we need plasteel ingots, I think, as well. And plasteel is titanium plus lithium. And I, and I've got, I think I've got plenty of lithium now. Uh, I left it in the ores. One, two, three, four, five, and five of these. One, two, three, four, five. So that'll be easy to make those into. One, two, three, four, and five. Okay, so those are plasteel ingots. So we need soccer teeth. Um, five. So, soccer teeth. Which means I need stasis rifle. I did find the other pieces of the stasis rifle also while I was out exploring. So, what does it take to make stasis rifle? Um, advanced wiring, bi battery, and titanium. Okay, so advanced wiring, computer chip, and gold. And computer chip. So we need silver, two cable coral, and a quartz. Uh, silver, how much silver? Two silver, quartz. Man, my, my memory is like a sneeze and I forget. Um, and two table corals, which I think I've got the coral. I didn't pick up very many more. Yeah, I didn't pick up any common. Uh, I picked up some, but I was also processing water, so I used up some things. Um, and then gold. Nighttime approaches. Well, I have the table. Did I not just grab table coral? Did I not just pick up table coral? That's common coral. All oh. All right, let's go stab a couple. Oops, I need to fix that. I might need some more of those as well, so. Oh, what's this? I swear there's a bunch of these around here that I just cannot scan or do anything with. I don't know what has changed, but. Alright, knife. Get some of those. Table coral. Why am I getting creep vine? I 
That's so weird. Okay, is that everything? Uh, I think so. So as you can see, I've got a bunch of uh, entries now. I've got that entry down there. I've got an entry there. I've got an entry up there and an entry up on top, plus the moon pool. It's really coming together nicely. Ten seconds of oxygen oh, I'm good. I'm good. Okay, so... Ah, oh, buddy. Computer chip. Advanced wiring. Um, battery, so I need uh, copper. Just one more copper. And I think all the copper is here. It's good that I've been scavenging so much stuff I can finally, like, just make most things. Battery. And... Um... Uh, one titanium. And I saw a titanium here that didn't belong, so perfect. And let's go ahead and put this corals. Okay, I wanted to stay survival so I can kill the stalkers a wee bit easier. I want to make one of those too, but yeah. Okay, so we've got. Uh, let me put. You know what I should do is I need a quartz and a titanium. I've got one. Okay. Just have like a little dump chest right here. I'm gonna call it tools. All right, we'll drop uh, the terraformer and laser cutter. And then also drop the tab builder and the signal. That should be good to go. Okay, so let's uh, assign that. So we gotta go find ourselves some stalkers. Uh, ideally, we do this in the daytime. You know what I should do as well before I go aboard, Captain. too far is I should equip the welder and fix this because oops this needs a little bit of love it's hard to see that there we go okay and two I love Vic. <laughs> okay, that should be where we saw those. Uh, I mean, they should be around the. Um, oh, what am I trying to think? The squiggly seaweed. The seaweed. That's what it's called. Okay, that's daytime. Good. Okay, stalkers, where are you? Oh. Oh, I don't have... This looks good. Is there anything I can scan? Any lockers? Any... No? Nothing? Nothing good? It's 
cool looking, but pointless. Huh. Nothing worth getting. Alright, so I need to find some, I still need to find some stalkers, so. It's like they were everywhere a few minutes ago. There, there we go. No? You're not the right kind. Do you drop teeth? Do you? Refined samples. Yeah, something is something is doing with the new version. And I'm gonna die if I keep doing that. Leave me alone. Okay, so it was dropping creep vine samples. Which is a bit unnerving, to tell you the truth. Sand shark, be good. I will zap your ass. Alright, let's look for... Stalkers. Come on, guys, you were... You were just here. My goodness, it was like I literally couldn't swim anywhere without seeing them. And now they're impossible to find. Hey, buddy. Oh, we gotta go down the hall. Oh, wow. It's a deep and dark hole. Now, I think that I can find some magnetite down here. So let me, uh, let me check that real quick. There we go. I've been meaning to come get this forever, but I just didn't. Uh, Alright, so anyway, we can make a compass now. Which is kind of handy. Yeah, this is an awesome cave. Now, to get back out of here. Careful, don't cause too much damage. Awesome! All right, well, I'm going to, let's see. Let me go see if I can find some, some stalkers and I'll bring you guys back when I've actually got some.
Actually, we're full. I'm gonna run back home, dump stuff off, then come back and find stalkers. So I'll be right back. So the the best and only way I've gotten the stalker teeth so far has been by getting them to chew on the sea moth, and they'll sometimes leave behind a tooth. And I've gotten. Or if they chew on metal fragments, um, that will also sometimes cause them to drop teeth. But just killing them outright does not seem to get them to drop a tooth. So come on, buddy, come on. I think I killed him. All right, let's see if he uh, dropped a tooth anywhere. Are you dead or are you alive? Are you unconscious -y? All right, let's see if you dropped a tooth anywhere here. Can you see one? Right there. So that's the best way to get it. So that's four. I want to get a few more as well. Always grab. It's nice now that I'm getting salt off of the... Um, can you? What the heck is happening? Yeah, something in my save game versus the patch has been not good. Um, they recommend that you started a new, whoops, a new game, and now I'm thinking back that. Well, I mean, I was, I'm so far into it that I don't want to start over, but I'm thinking I maybe should have, could have, would have. All right. So I'm gonna go ahead and see if I can grab a few more. If you really want to get this, it's really out of time, but I think I can go ahead and still get the Cyclops built uh, before the end of the episode. So give me a few minutes and I'll fin finish gathering resources. All right, I picked up the Midi Nama Glass um, and I've got the Nama Glass. I thought I had, did I grab a little bit? Two, so we need an advanced wiring kit and two lubricants. Okay. Advanced wiring kit and two lubricants. I know we've already got the lubricants made. Advanced wiring kit should be easy cheesy as well. And that's the gold and two and the computer chip. So the gold was table coral, silver and quartz. And I still don't have. Ah, be right back. Alright, I grabbed some extra ones as well. So I had more. Oh, I did have some. Alright, um, and I thought I put the other enamel glass there. Two lubricants there. And we'll need two golds. Ah. Eh. Uh, no, computer chip, silver and quartz. And a quartz. Makey, makey. Bakey. And then the two golds. There's gold. Now I need another place to put more corals. Uh, I'll take the teeth out. I'll put the teeth in the crystals for right now. All right. Um, so, oh, I can make the compass too. Let's grab that one while I'm thinking about it. Think at our tools. A computer, another computer chip. 
Um, we can do it. Let's just do that. Let's do it. Let's do it. Um, computer chip. Quartz. Equipment. Compass. Woohoo, ja! Then we got a compass going. Should get that. I should have got that a long time ago, but um There we go. Compass. Um so let me store the signal in here. So, do we have everything? Do we have the advanced wiring kit? Advanced wiring kit. Plasteel. Two lubricants. Enamel glass. Okay, I think we got everything. Let's go build this puppy. Man, what an awesome base. So awesome. In case you guys didn't catch where I got the magnetite from, there's the cave that's over that way. Entrance to those big, huge blue mushrooms, and they always have the... There it is. Oh! I love how this thing splashes into the water. I built this when it first came out, um, and that was the last time that I, <laughs> I built the Cyclops. Kersh Bloosh. Awesome. Alright, let's go check it out. There she blows. It's gorgeous. I wonder if they've made any changes interiorly wise. I might make a second Seamoth um that would be exclusive for the ship. Captain. All systems online. Hey, excellent. Okay, up there. Engine compartment. Six power cells. For powers. Entrance to the Seamoth Bay. So we'll put in some... Uh, we'll use the... Bobber. We'll put in some lockers here. Yeah, I don't have anything right now, so. We can come up with a name for it, too. Uh, so, guys, suggest, suggest a name. Nice bright colors. Now, this doesn't have a very, it's only like 100 meters uh, before it starts to get some damage. And 200 meters, I think, is the crush depth on it, if I remember right. Uh, so it can't go that deep, but it's an awesome mobile base. Well, that's funny, you can see that uh, through the through the bay, you can see that, that uh, storage unit. Actually, you can see that one over there, too. That's weird. And you see all of them. That's really weird. Can you see them outside too? No, it's just if you're inside. That's funky. If you're inside the Cyclops, you can see inside your base. That is bizarre. All right. Uh, I'm going to build another Seamoth between episodes uh just so we have an extra one for that um and i'm gonna go back again to that island 
and scan the exterior um, bobber which I need. Okay, where did I leave the... Did they, put, did they dock to see the last seam off? Did I, did I, did I? I did. Okay. All right. Good. All right. Anyway, for now, it's been wrong with the bulb. If you guys enjoyed it, click that like button. Let me know ideas for name for that. And I will talk to you all later. Bye-bye.